Good morning. Man, it's cold out there. I thought I was going to be sliding on ice the whole way here. <laughs> Heaven forbid, no. I prefer my head goose egg free. <gasps> my time has come. I am bestowed with a cute frilly apron. I feel so pretty. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Teach me the ways of Coco, Sensei. What's first? Ganache it is. Do you have a recipe? Okay. Well, I trust you. What do I need to get? Really? That's all a ganache is? Cream and chocolate? Oh, that makes sense. Are we just making a plain one? No? What flavor, then? Coffee? <laughs> now you're just trying to seduce me, miss. Well, who doesn't love coffee and chocolate together? So, do you keep all of your recipes in your head? Uh, I, I don't know if I could remember all of that. <laughs> So you do have things written down. That's good. Uh, is there a recipe book around here I could reference if I get stuck? Oh, you just have it in that tiny little notebook? Your handwriting must be immaculate. Okay, if I copy it down, it won't be nearly that neat or that small. Uh, yeah, sure. I'll be careful with it. I know these recipes are literally the lifeblood of this place. <clears throat> I promise to protect these valuable secrets with my life. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I think that's the first time I've heard you laugh. You have a really nice laugh. I hope I can get more of them out of you. But, I mean... We're working with chocolate and cookies. It should be fun, too, right? Yes, ma'am. So, I just add the coffee beans to the boiling cream. Okay, and how long do we infuse for? You got it. Just turn the heat off and stir. Mmm, that smells so good. Okay, what's next? You're kidding me! 500 cookies? Sold in three hours? That's incredible! Oh, you must have been exhausted. I imagine you were ready to run out the door when your relief came in. What do you mean, no one came to help? Good morning, you two. I trust things are going smoothly here. Yes, we've been having a ball. Oh, and who might you- Hi! I'm Stacy, and it's so lovely to have you here with us. I hope you've been enjoying your first shift so far. Oh, well, I'm just on trial today, but fingers crossed I get in. Oh, I'm sure you will! I can see you already have plenty of assets. <laughs> uh, thanks. So, should I move to a different task? Is Stacy going to take over here and... <laughs> oh, no need to worry. I'll be on the computer for a while. Updating the website, social media, all that stuff. I'll dig into the kitchen stuff a bit later. I hope our girl here hasn't been giving you any trouble. No, ma'am. She's an utter delight. <laughs> of course she is. Well, I have other things to do. I'll be in my office if anyone needs me, but do try not to. Yikes. So is that the usual time they come in? 
What time does Stacy start to help you back here? It varies. Uh. Oh, so Stacy's the manager's daughter. Sharon's the boss. I see. So Stacy gets a little leeway. I guess I kind of understand that, but I'm just trying to picture how you do everything we did this morning by yourself. You cut some things out, right? That's not the usual routine. Wow, that's... That is easily the work of three people. Never mind one. I... <clears throat> uh, well, I guess we better keep at it and hope that Sharon likes my work. Because you definitely shouldn't be doing this on your own. You're welcome. Happy to help. Speaking of which, what's next on the list? Um, t tempting? Oh, tempering. You mean making the chocolate all shiny and nice? I've always been fascinated by how it works. Yeah, sure thing. I imagine it takes a while to get right, so I'm happy to just watch. Oh my god, so much chocolate. I just want to stick my face in it. What type's your favorite? Fair, it's a tough choice. I'd probably go with semi-sweet dark. <laughs> I'm glad my choice pleases you. Okay, so talk me through what you're doing so I can write this down. There's more than one tampering method? And which one is this? Seeding. Okay. And what do you do next? Okay, okay. Heat to 45 degrees. Then add solid chocolate in and mix. And that's just what you're doing now? Cool, cool, cool. How long have you been working with food? Only a year? But surely you've worked at other places before this. You're kidding. So it wasn't until you started here you really got to bake and create stuff like this? That's crazy. The way you handle yourself, it's like you've been doing this for years. <laughs> I'm in awe. Are... are you blushing? Sure, sure. I totally didn't find your soft spot. Oh, it's ready? How can you tell? You didn't even put the thermometer in. Damn, you're good. But this newbie would like to know what temp to look for. 29 degrees. Okay, and that's guaranteed to be good to go. What's the test? Dip the parchment paper. Like this? Okay, I have put it on the bench. Now what? I am watching. Watching. What? Wait. No way. It solidified so fast. Mm, but it's less shiny than the ones on display. Oh, that's cool. Chocolate only shiny when solidifying on a shiny surface. Those look like molds for delicious chocolates. We're going to pour the tempered chocolate in there. Sweet. See? I'm learning. 
Oop, do you need to check that? I can handle filling molds for a minute. I promise not to just pour it straight into my mouth. Oh, do you need help with... Nope, you've already got it. Don't worry, chocolate's still going into molds, I'm good. How the hell does she balance all of this herself? This is crazy. Cooking, baking, serving customers. I hope I get to stay on and learn more things just so she has more hands helping her. Hey, handsome! Look at you learning the ropes! Uh, yeah, getting the hang of it. There's certainly a lot to learn. Um, I know those cookies just came out of the oven, so do they need... Oh, she'll get to them when she's done with that customer. Here, I can show you a trick for removing the excess. Sure, I guess. So you take this scraper, and you put it here, and then you just gotta... Gotta... Uh, scrape off the excess. Are you okay? Stupid thing is broken. Hey! It's messed up! Get it right next time! I'll be back at the computer. Jesus, she's something else. I'm so sorry about the mold. I, I didn't know what to even do. You can? I thought it was ruined. The chocolate's too firm to scrape off. How would you fix it? A what? I thought they were only for thawing pipes and stripping old paint. You guys don't mess around. Use a heat gun if chocolate is too firm to gently reheat. So Stacy tried to scrape it one way, but it didn't work. How do you do it? Yeah, that makes far more sense. And look at that, it's perfect. You keep on surprising me with your genius. Oh, thanks for fixing that for me. I can start to show Prince Charming here how to fill the chocolates now. I think she was about to... Don't be silly! Besides, loser, I can see your special friend just came in the door. You know just the way he likes his coffee. If I go over there, he's just going to ask for you anyway. You know what Mom says, the customer is always right. Off you go. Why is Stacy so eager to get rid of her? And why did she look so nervous? Who is that guy? Hey, Stacy, can I get your help with something? My mouth stopped working. Uh, fine. I'll be right back. Don't you go anywhere. Okay. She's taking that guy's order, but I can tell even from back here she's either straight up scared or completely creeped out. Maybe I should check on her. Yes, I will have my usual and whatever special cookie you've made today. But I can't let you leave without at least a smile, my little dove. Wait... Did this guy really just say that to her? Oh, come on, my little dove. You look so pretty when you smile. Oh, hell no. 